Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to create a custom toolbar in Android Studio. It's pretty simple, let's go! First, let's create a toolbar layout, in resources, layout, new, layout resource file. File name is toolbar and root element is AppCompat widget toolbar. Click OK, then split the code, let's set the background, background, for example, material color, choose what you want. I want to choose material primary color and it's our toolbar. Let's change the height of our toolbar. Height is wrap content. OK. And we can add the shadow elevation, for example, 8 dp. It's good. Then connect our toolbar to activity main layout, split the code, and here include layout, layout toolbar. Close the tag. Toolbar have appeared on main activity layout. It's good. And let's add the ID. ID plus ID XML toolbar. OK. Go to main activity Kotlin file. Find the toolbar. Toolbar equals find view by ID, type is toolbar, Android app compat widget, and where resource.id.xml toolbar. OK, let's run the application. We have two toolbars. Let's fix it. Let's delete the default toolbar. Go to values, then themes, themes.xml, and here change style name to no action bar. OK, let's run again. We have only one toolbar, our custom toolbar, but here we haven't an application name and we haven't a menu icons. Let's fix it. Go to main activity and let's write set support action bar. Toolbar is our toolbar. OK, let's run again. And now we have the application name, but we haven't a menu icon. Let's fix it. Let's create a menu in resources, new Android resource directory, resource type is menu and OK. We have a menu folder, right click on it, new menu resource file, file name is top menu and OK. Now let's split the code and add the item, item and title, for example, settings. Close the tag. Next, go to main activity and override on options, on create options menu function. Create inflator from menu inflator, then inflator dot inflate r resource dot menu dot top menu. And here write menu. Return true. And let's run the application. Now we have the settings button. And if you want to make the font of text and icons white, you need to change the theme style. Go to our toolbar, layout, toolbar, and write here theme style. And if we use a light style, then we get a dark text. And if you use the dark action bar style, then we get a white text. Let's check it. We run the application and now we have a white text and white icons. If you want to get an icon instead three dots then then go to menu top menu dot xml and here write for example icon and choose our icon in drawable folder. Run the application we haven't icon because here we need to add show action if room. We run and we have a menu icon instead three dots. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for the watching. Like, subscribe. Have a nice day. Have a good coding. See you.